Hi everyone, my name is John Healy, I'm the principal here at Cork College of Faith, Mano Campus. So in this information session, we're going to be covering uh, a number of different things. Um, first, we're going to focus on how to apply for one of our courses uh, starting in September. So the first thing you need to do is go to mallowcampus.ie. So we get our web page then appearing. So then click on what course area you'd like to uh, apply for. So you see along the top, we have applied science, the apprenticeship, business, computing, early learning care, care and beauty, health and social studies. So click which we want. If you're not sure, have a look at our prospectus. So I'm going to click on business. So inside there, then click on the course that you're looking for. So I'm going to click on business management. When you, when you go in there, then what you're going to do is going to click start application. So that will take you through the process. You're going into your personal details. And then what will happen is we will follow on with an email to call you for a short interview. Now, when people hear the word interview, sometimes they, you know, they might get, uh, I suppose, a bit nervous. But the interview is more like a chat. We talk to you one to one just to make sure you're suited to the course. And then we take on board any questions that you may have. So in this information system, we're going to focus on our business courses. So we're going to explore our level five and level six courses. And throughout the session, I'm joined by a number of different course coordinators who will give you their view on the courses that we have in offer. So I'm going to start off and I'm going to guide you through our business management QQI level six course. So this is level six course. So this will be a follow on to our level five courses that are on offer. Um, so anyone that has done a previous level five uh, business course uh, can apply for this. So in terms of this course, I suppose we go a step beyond our level five course. So we have a number of different modules with business management, human resources, spreadsheets level six, word processing level six, work experience level six, leadership, um, and then a few other modules such as event management and digital presentations. So they're all pitched at level six. So it's what you've learned at level five, but a step further. And I suppose this is with Suhei when he maybe wants to become an office manager or enhance their skills in a number of different areas. So this is a very popular course for those who've done level five and who are looking to continue on with us. Uh, work experience uh, is a part of all our courses. So in this particular course, there are 60 hours of work experience, and this is completed usually in semester two. I suppose the thing that we do here, and you'll hear this from a number of different course coordinators, is that we have semesterized uh, a lot of our courses. So you do four modules from September to December, and you do four from January to May. And we find that this helps students on their, on their journey with us. So it takes the pressure off instead of studying eight modules starting in September. So we semesterize across the year. College calendar follows the same calendar as a school calendar. So you start uh, in mid September, you finish in May. Uh, midterms, Christmas, Easter uh, would be off the same as any other school. In terms of career progressions, so again, you're looking at maybe going to administration, maybe as an office manager, uh, any sort of a business administration role. You cover payroll, finance, and bookkeeping level five. So that's also useful to have in your CV. So really, there's a number of different avenues that you can go for with this uh, QQI Business Level 6. Just remember on site, and you'll hear this throughout this information session, that we have a cafe, free parking, you get a student ID card, you have access to two career guidance counsellors, and we offer disability support if you need some extra help. There's an active student council, and you will be signed up to, you'll get a college email, and all our resources are also available on our Moodle site which will be covered at orientation and also we offer Erasmus. So Erasmus gives the opportunity to work abroad for two weeks fully funded by the EU uh, and in 2022-2023 we're looking at uh, countries such as Spain, Sweden, Poland, France and Portugal. If you want to find out more about fees and grants head to mallowcollege.ie forward slash funding and aside there you'll find information on SUSE, VITAS and Better Education and Laws. So really, if you want any more information on our business level six course, head to mallowcampus.ie. So next up, we're going to explore our level five courses uh, that we have. Okay, everyone, so we're, we're joined here with Siobhan, um, and we're going to talk through our business computers for adults course. Um, so this course is based in Charleville, but also an offer in Mallow Campus. So you have two, you have two options. Um, so Siobhan, just to kick us off, uh, this course is a very popular course, Business Computers for Adults. Um, so just to give us a bit of an overview, what would you say the course entails and who is it suited to? Well, John, it's a very good combination of, um, I suppose, computer subjects and business subjects for somebody maybe looking to return to the workforce, maybe somebody who feels that their um, computer skills 
need to be updated or, um, or maybe they, they just don't have the skills to begin with. It's a really good starting point, um, you know, to, to maybe work in any sort of office environment, administration assistant and in payroll and um, receptionist, any of that type of work, it, it would really set you up well for, for that, those type of jobs. Excellent. So it, it's, kind of, it's a broad course, but it, it kind of opens the avenues to different things. And as you said there, it covers different aspects like payroll, bookkeeping, spreadsheets, yeah, business administration. So it covers a lot of things. And I suppose if you are looking maybe to change jobs or get into something different, it's it's a broad course. And I suppose the big thing about this course is that we it's it's done at a steady pace as well. Yeah, so we really try and target the, the, the students that are enrolled for this course. Um, we, we target the level to, to suit. But so we might have some people who might have very poor computer skills and others who are maybe looking to, to retrain and upskill. Um, so we start at whatever level is needed for the students that we, we, we have on the course. Um, and like I said, there's a good combination of business subjects and computer subjects to, um, to, you know, to keep it interesting as well. Excellent, yeah. So it was a good mix. And I suppose what helps in as well is that we do do a lot of semesterization. So predominantly we might do four modules before Christmas and four after Christmas. So that kind of helps as well with, you know, we're not straight into eight modules in the start of September. Yeah, absolutely. The semesterization takes the pressure off and that you're you're really only managing four modules at a time, um, which, you know, is good. You can focus entirely on those four, get them completed, you know, all going well before Christmas um, and kind of park those then, you know, uh, there is, your assessments are done and then you start your four new modules after Christmas and you can kind of just, you know, you're only focusing at four, four at a time, which is great. Excellent. So... Look, I think it's, it's it's a good course, and I suppose look, it, it, in the past it would uh, attract some some mature students that you know maybe looking to change careers, and um, and but it's it's a very broad course, so it's open to everyone, um, and I suppose moving on then as part of all our courses, we would have work a work experience element as well. So normally it's sixty hours, and normally you want to do that in sort of a, in a, an area that they're interested in, isn't it? Yeah, so we'd always encourage students to you know look for work experience in a place that they'd like to you know to see themselves working in the future, um. You know, they, they generally get a two week placement, usually kind of um, in semester two, um, where they'd actually start to put some of the, you know, what they've learned in semester one, then into practice as well, which is great. Well, it, it, it's just good opportunities. So in terms of careers, we kind of mentioned there, it, this is a broad course, so it opens the doors to numerous things. And I know on a weekly basis, I would get five or six emails every week looking for people to, to work in administration, but that's only one element, I suppose. You have the bookkeeping, the payroll, a bit of marketing so you've a bit, it's, it's it's very broad so there is a lot of options you want for career progression yeah there, there, there is a lot i suppose any business course always kind of covers a huge area like business is a very broad area anyway so um like as you mentioned you know any office positions reception jobs secretarial payroll bookkeeping a uh, personal assistant you know um accounts clerk kind of a thing anything like that you you'd be well prepared um by the end of this course excellent and as we said at the start this is based in either Charleville or Mallow, so there's an option in both places. Um, and I suppose just to highlight that, we do offer extra support in. So let's just say you've been out of college a while or you haven't been you, know, you haven't been in college for a long time and you've been working and it's totally new to you. Don't worry, we take it slowly and there will be support as well if people need it. You know, I think that's a big thing. Um, in terms of the college calendar, we follow the school calendar. So we go from September to May, uh, midterms and Christmas and all that is actually the same as a school calendar. So it's very school friendly as well for anyone that's looking at that side of it from school friendly hours. And um, just in terms of learner services, so in both Charleville and in Mallow, there's there's three parking on site. You get student ID cards, you have access to career guidance and counselling, disability supports, and also there's an opportunity to go abroad through our Erasmus Plus programme where you can do your two weeks of work experience abroad and that's fully funded by the EU. Uh, in terms of fees, if you go to manocollege.ie forward slash funding, you can check out the fees for each course and also the funding options that are available. So Suzy, Vitas and Back to Education are up here with Owen. Owen's our course coordinator for our office administration course. Um, so Owen, you're very welcome. Um, in terms of, I suppose, just to dive straight into it, this course is, is a very broad course. So would you just give us maybe an overview of what the course entails? Yeah, yeah, no problem. So basically, it's a it's a excellent foundation of all elements of of business. So from um, marketing, digital marketing, um, payroll, bookkeeping, um, and then your your various um, Microsoft Office packages as well. So it basically sets you up to work in um, any office or business situation um, and gives you a kind of a broad detail of 
of everything you need to do going out into into various different industries. Yeah, no, I think it's good. As you said, there it's broad, and, that, and that's the key. I think in any going to any walk of life today, whatever course you do, that it, it opens the door. So, like, I think for anyone that's looking to go into administration, payroll, and bookkeeping, marketing, you know, and obviously your administration and spreadsheets and word processing are essential for any any job today. Really, I think, isn't it? Yeah, without a doubt. And then we have various packages, then like Socrates as well, which are very specific Socrates in particular to the to the medical um secretary industry but i would have found that um all industries kind of use a, a similar um system say if you go into a um say a different industry like um say um ordering or kind of food industry all of them would have a similar kind of system um, within their offices that again we'd we kind of train you up on similar to Socrates. excellent and as you said there i think that's good like it's not just the business or office industry just this qualification kind of gets you into any industry really you know i think it's a good it's a good starting point and just in terms of the students then like you know on you've, you've been on this course now a long time it, like we get mature students we get school leavers so it's kind of it's open to everyone really isn't it yeah everybody um there's a, a huge range of people that that come on the course and and everybody really gels well um again we have people who are, are looking to upskill and get back into the workforce or else um say school leavers who maybe aren't quite ready yet to, to go on to, to college or school leavers who, who feel that having a, a general basis um, behind them um, is, is the best start for them. And I see people really um, benefiting from, from that side of things and getting used to say completing assignments, deadlines, um, doing your semesterization say for, for 12 weeks. And um, because it is different to, to your, your normal um, school life and school day, um, but also then um, we have a, an excellent cohort of, of mature students that, that really drive the, the college and the course on. Um, and I think everybody gels well and uh, enjoys it and was certainly the case this year in this course anyway. Oh, excellent. Um, and I suppose just moving on then work experience is an element in all courses here. So on this particular course, 60 hours of work experience is needed. And in general, people would try and go into an office environment really regardless of industry own, isn't it? Yeah, I suppose it's, it's great when people come in and they, they kind of know an industry that they like. So it might be um, the sports industry, it might be a marketing industry, food industry, but you can relate this course then into, into any industry. So with your experience here, uh, what you learned, you could still work in um, a reception desk in a gym or in the, the account section in a gym if, if sport is your passion. Or likewise, if it's, um, say, the medical side of things or even working in, in different various offices so um, or even schools and stuff like that. So it's great when people kind of come in and they, they have a bit of knowledge or it might be just um, a, a contact in a, in a different business um, and they kind of know what they're going to be going out doing and work experience. It's usually in semester two, two so you have a bit of time to, um, to build up um, and see where you want to go. But it's great and people people really enjoy and i think that the, kind of when they come back from work experience they can really see the the benefits of what they've done throughout the course um because they, they get to use in a in a real life situation you know yes excellent and i suppose that's that's the joys of work experience that it brings the theory that you're learning in the classroom into the into the workplace in terms of the college calendar so our, all our courses here follow the the academic year the same as any school so uh midterms christmas easter and then may you'll be finishing so it's a, it, it follows the same timeline as that so in terms of career progressions and we've mentioned this there's this, this course opens the doors to different things as owen said it's different industries uh, and i suppose look we have people that come in and definitely want to be an administrator whereas someone else might come in to get some tales from it so on there's a, there's a number of options and i suppose also we have level six here as well that can people can progress onto as well yeah um and level six again is a, is a, an excellent advancement um but again like we said um people could go out and work in the accounts department within a within an industry or within a business or the, again they could be working in a again there's just a huge amount of um say call centers but just general businesses around Mallow as well which are constantly getting on to us um looking for for good new people that are that are kind of newly trained up in the in the courses that are that are kind of relevant to the industry because again everything is moving so quickly with regards to email um microsoft word microsoft office google drive um social media and 
we cover we cover a lot of that throughout the course. Yes, no, it's good, and there's those options, and it's also there. I regularly get emails as well from local employers looking to take on people, so there's loads of career opportunities when you've this course completed. Just in terms of learner services, there's a number of services, uh, but I suppose just to highlight there, we have free parking on site. There's a cafe available. Guidance and counselling services are available. There's disability support for anyone that might need extra support, and a very active student council as well. Another part uh, that people can apply for is an Erasmus Plus program. Erasmus Plus involves going abroad for two weeks and doing work experience in your area of study. And this is fully funded by the EU. So again, that's open to everyone to apply for when they do a course here in Mallow Campus. Uh, in terms of fees, if you want to check out the, the fundings uh, attached to this course, uh, head to mallowcollege.ie forward slash funding. Check out Susie Vitas and Beth Education. That's something you might be eligible for. Um, again, if you have any queries at any stage, make sure to contact us here. Um, so if you want any more information on this course or any of our courses, just head to mallowcampus.ie. Here with Sandra. Sandra is our course coordinator for our medical office administrator course. Um, so what we're going to do is we're just going to talk briefly through uh, the course and looking at, at career options as well. So Sandra, just to start us off, this course, what, what, can you just give us a general overview of what the course entails? Yeah, perfect, John. So I suppose, again, there's there is practical elements and there's theory kind of elements to a lot of the modules. So I suppose I might just give you a brief outline of maybe the subjects that are involved. So again, I suppose you start off maybe with the, the medical side of it. So you have your anatomy and you have your medical terminology. You will also have bookkeeping, payroll, work experience, communications. And then I suppose you look at like the likes of Word, um, spreadsheets, uh, audio transcription, um, text production and I suppose an extra thing that we have as well with our medical um, course here is we also do um, Socrates package which is um, used in the vast majority of doctor surgeries so again it kind of just it sets our students up I suppose for the working world of going into the medical sector. Excellent. So that, as you said, there, there's, a, there's a broad spread of modules. There so is. we have the medical side of it, but also you have the core administration roles that you would do. So I think this is a very good course because you're getting the medical side of it, but you're also open to, to working in any sort of administration role. And in today's world, people need the bookkeeping, they need the payroll, they need marketing. So I think it's, it's a very good course. And as you said, then we have the extra Socrates package, which is a, an extra add on as well. It is, yeah. Uh, it's an all-round kind of course and as you said there while i suppose it is geared towards the medical side again sometimes students might figure out depending on either job opportunities or during the year that maybe the medical side isn't for them but you still have the whole office administration so, so it's just the extra modules so it's just keeping your options open really excellent and i suppose just in terms of the, the students then what like who, the course is open to everyone really like isn't it it's it from is. students to younger learners so, you know so it's it's we, we, we like in the past what would be your experience and the learners that come on the course? I suppose, like what you said there, there, there's a variety of students. You have maybe the student that has maybe, some might have worked maybe kind of in um, in pharmacies and things like that before, I suppose, um, at the counter and that and realize maybe the medical side is the way to go. Others might be coming back upskilling. Others are diversifying completely. Um, we have other students who maybe now that their, their own kids have kind of gone on to school, that they're kind of thinking about themselves going back into the working world haven't maybe been in formal education for for a few years and I suppose they're just kind of looking to see what is the kind of course for them so again that this would set them up for that. And I suppose for anyone that has been away from education for a long while like we, we don't we don't go 100% uh, you know really quick into the course uh, it's semesterized as well so yes. that helps you know you're not focusing on eight modules starting off you're starting with four so we ease people into it and obviously look we're here to support people along the way so that, i think that's a big thing here sandra which semesterization we kind of absolutely the whole thing yeah and as you said there and it's just like like the fact of if it was somebody who hasn't been in education for a while or just the, the bit of fear kind of of getting back into things like i think the four subjects kind of before christmas and your four afterwards makes it somewhat easier for everybody and then at least i said once you kind of get over the first few or once you get over your first assignment which is a big hurdle for a lot you know when they haven't done it in a while it's a big achievement and then once you kind of realize you have the four done the other four hopefully will come kind of easier to them yeah no that's excellent so just moving on into work experience so all courses here are qqi and there's a work experience element so on this particular course they have to do two weeks of work experience basically 60 hours so yes. in the past where would have where have students gone for this sort of work experience yeah so um i suppose again 
as we said earlier, it can either be the medical side or you might only get kind of office kind of work depending on um, some doctor surgery mightn't let you in there. But we have some people who have gone to medical practices. Um, we've also had some people going to hospitals as well and some people who might just go the, the general office route. But we've had a variety kind of, of places. And I do think the, the two weeks work experience are invaluable to students because, again, you kind of get to see like we can set them up for as much as we can within the classroom, but I suppose getting out into the working world to see, um, do they like it? What is it like? And I suppose bringing all the skills and experience that they've learned here in the college out to the working world is, is brilliant. And then we have students who, after the two weeks work experience, um, might try and gain employment in that side place once they've finished here with us in May. Yes, no, so there's excellent opportunities. And I suppose, Work experience as well kind of gives you an appetite if you actually like like the industry that you're you're hoping to go into. Um, Absolutely, yeah. So just in terms of the college calendar, so here our courses follow the school calendar really with the academic year. So from September to May and the normal breaks in terms of midterms, uh, Christmas and Easter. So we follow exactly the same thing. Um, so in terms of career progressions, we kind of touched on their standards. There's different routes. They, you know, you have the medical route or the general administration route. So what would you say to someone that's you know doing this course? Where where could they end up afterwards? Yeah, so like always said, I suppose you could have somebody, you could go down the medical route, so whether it is into doctor surgeries um, or into medical centres or hospitals, or again, as I said, some people might go on the lines of just keeping it the general office um, admin kind of work. And then we also have students who will either then um, maybe stay with us and do a level six as well, just to advance, I suppose, again, kind of yeah. their knowledge and that, that they realise maybe that after doing a year and here that, the, that they could do another year with yes. us as well so that's that's handy we have the level six here as well that people can progress on to as well yes. um just in terms of learner services so um we free parking we've a, we've a cafe on site every student gets id cards we've clear guidance counseling services we have disability support for anyone that feels that they may need some extra support there's an active student council and also then we have the erasmus plus program so Sandra, this is something you're involved in as well. So this is a good opportunity for people to get experience abroad and it's fully funded through the EU. Oh, absolutely. And so it said, so this is, instead you can do your two weeks work experience abroad instead of staying here kind of in Ireland. And as John, as you said, as I said, giving them an opportunity to go away. Sometimes we would have people, it might be their first time abroad or haven't been abroad in the last couple of years. Others might have been mothers who kind of are going away maybe for the first time without their kids and kind of, and just giving themselves a, a different kind of opportunity and then just seeing what it is like to work um, abroad in, in the said um, area. So again, whether it be the medical or the business sector. Excellent. So another good opportunity. Absolutely. So for fees and grant opportunities, uh, all that information is available on our website at mallowcollege.ie forward slash funding. So all our courses are open to SUS, EVITAS, back to education allowance if you are, if those are applicable to you. Um, so again, to, to get information on this course or any other courses, head to madocampus.ie.